dropping into the heart. Breathing. Taking the breath. And as you take in the breath, all the way to the top of the breath, bring in the father of your soul, the creator of all that is. Exhaling now, dropping into the heart, into the belly, falling deep into the core of the earth. Bowing your head when you come to the bottom of the breath. Acknowledging, accessing the Divine Mother, Mother of your soul. And coming back up into the body. Back up to reach into the core of the cosmos. Accessing Source love, the life force power of the universe, bringing this into your body on this day, wherever you may be, and falling again into the arms of the mother of your soul, and merging at the heart with the Christ Consciousness. Whomever that is for you, Lord Jesus, Lord Buddha, Yogananda, whatever resonates with you, whomever, all is one. As we breathe, noticing now the breath, notice that you, your breath passes through both nostrils as you breathe in, focusing on where it becomes one as the breath travels down into the lungs. Down into the belly. And exhaling, slowing down the heartbeat, and for some of you, there is no volume on your end, there is on mine, so we'll take the breath. And it's a good dial-in tone to create a few ohms. Breathing in and at the top of the breath, sounding your own Taking you into a deeper part of your heart. Guru Brahma, Guru Vishnu, Guru Devo Maheshwara. Guru Sakshat Param Brahma Tasmai Shri Guru Ve Nama Guru Brahma Guru Vishnu 
Guru Devo Maheshwara Guru Sakshat Param Brahma Tasmai Shri Guru Ve Nama With great respect and love I follow my heart my inner teacher. With great respect and love, I follow my heart. My inner teacher. Namaste. So calling on the life force power of the universe, the many and the one, The source of all that is one great love. Invoking the mother of your soul, merging with the father of your soul. Mother Earth, Mother Isis, Mother Mary. She has come so many times to show us all the way home to the heart. Choose your mother of your soul. I invoke Lord Jesus, Lord Buddha, Lord Maitreya, the cosmic Christ consciousness, making up the Trinity. And now invoking the upward facing pyramid, the downward facing pyramid, making the six pointed star of David, placing yourself within this divine Merkaba so that we all are supremely protected as we journey. as we breathe together. Breathing in and breathing out. Falling at the feet of mother of your soul. And seeing your tube of light your chakra column that begins at the tip of your crown and runs through your third eye, through your throat chakra, down your spine, through your heart, your solar plexus, your belly, your base chakra and down through your earth chakra and down into the core of the earth. Anchor now into the very heart of the Divine Mother. Mother Earth, Mother Isis, Mother Mary. Walking together with Divine Mother through the central chamber of the core of the earth. walking together to the greater inner chamber, her sacred place as we breathe. And there is a beautiful, exquisite pool before us, crystals, thousands of crystals down the walls. The waters of the Divine Mother running ever so quietly and gently over those crystals, caressing the walls of your heart, 
as you witness this pool the Divine Mother now inviting you to walk down the steps at the edge of the pool and stepping in waist deep now and diving in and it is a sacred caress the pores of your skin as you swim and roll onto your back are drawing in these waters this liquid love feel these waters soothe you on a soul level it's like mother's milk and yet these waters are transparent crystal clear literally crystalline waters the pores of your skin drinking drawing in to all your bodies and systems this nectar so that your blood is transporting this nectar throughout all your bodies and systems so that your nervous system your emotional body mental body all are being calmed soothed and bathed so you can feel this resonance now truly stroking your nervous system so that you're falling into the resonance of the Divine Mother herself there is a commune communion feeling somewhat hypnotic but it is more and truly is the communion with her that feels the soothing elements of her touch for indeed everything my voice your breath the bird song outside is her Shakti. Allow her Shakti to caress you. To calm the inner echelons of your heart chakra. bring you into a true state of being merging now more deeply with her whether it is Ama your teacher specifically fall into her arms the Christ consciousness has now stepped into the center as you ongoingly throughout this meditation drink liquid love through the pores of your skin 
the Christ consciousness is now in the very center of your heart, the center of the sacred chamber. As you breathe, in and out, and the Christ consciousness has his hand on the back of your heart chakra and the front. There is a warmth and a presence and exactly what you need is flowing through into your heart. The Divine Mother is holding you and you are able to surrender even more now. Fall into her embrace. She uh, is behind you. She has both her arms around your shoulders. Fall back and allow her embrace to feed you. Know that she gives unto you all that you need right now. She knows everything. Begin to allow the past week, the last few weeks, the months of this year, just allow them to fall all around you as if you are discarding cloaks. Like pixels on the TV screen. They are dissolving and falling away. Take advantage now and place into the dissolving uh, moments now, still occurring, any uh, dramas, traumas, occurrences, Anything that you have tucked away, hidden even from yourself, old memories, just push them out through your skin boundary and into the ongoing uh, picture dissolving occurrence. It's like we're dissolving files. Many, many files. Push them out. Even if you can only uh, feel them, you don't have to describe them in your mind. Don't go to that part of your mind. Just push out the emotions of fear, of guilt, not being good enough, whatever it might be of being overwhelmed, push that out, of everything being too much, push it away and out of your system. The Christ still has both his hands on your heart. We all need this. And now there is a sense of something uh, 
uh, anchoring you into your deeper heart, calling you to fall deeper, to focus there. The, the surrendering of the pixels has uh, come to its completion. However, if you need to keep throwing things out, do so. But the focus now is to drop deeper into the heart, into the anchor, and to follow that cycling that goes deeper. And we're falling into perhaps echelons that we have not been to, haven't had time. It's all been too much. Just keep falling. Knowing that the Christ consciousness has you, has your back. The Divine Mother has your back. And so that assists you to fall and to completely let go. And there is a, a nectar, a well there. And touch your feet in an animated way, of course. Touch your feet into this well so that you are uh, having a foot bath together with uh, drawing the nectar into your heart and breathe. It is feeding you, feeding all of the characters that you've ever been across all time. So, so many. Feeding you, feeding each part out of, of who you have ever been. strengthening bringing into your being a rejuvenation you can go on you can walk forward you do have the strength you have the endurance. You have everything that is required to continue on this journey. Whatever you need, the Christ Consciousness, the Divine Mother is right there. Ask them. Ask now. Perhaps you need clarity. Perhaps you need solace, rest. Allow the Christ Consciousness to give this to you. Receive it. Ask the Divine Mother to help you to receive everything she has for you. Everything. Drink it in. You are 100% absorbing, receiving like a sponge the goodness, her tender touch. Your DNA, your blueprint. is becoming more enlivened. And we're being asked now to rise up through your chakra column to uh, completely uh, contain and uh, be full, rise up into your fullness, 
fill your chakra column about as uh, wide in circumference as a baseball. Fill it now with your golden nectar fed through your heart, feeding uh, all the way down to the base of your spine deep into the core of the earth. This sweet nectar fills you completely, rising now above your heart, rising into the throat, the sixth chakra, the seventh chakra. And allowing now the overflowing all around you 360 degrees filling your 24 bodies and systems don't think just know that all your bodies and systems are overflowing now all around you covering the outside of your physical body yet you are still rising into your eighth chakra filling this chakra about a foot above your head and overflowing from there your aura stretches out all around you. It has expanded uh, larger than the room you are in. Feel the pulsation of your auric field. The posture of your chakra column as your heart beats as your blood moves through all your limbs throughout your organs this nectar pulsates not only through your 24 bodies and systems, but into your auric field. We're going to stretch now. We're going to stretch horizontally around the earth. Stretch out. At first we're st stretching 180 degrees. And now we're bringing it around to the 360. And breathe all the way back to your heart. Stretching out all around the earth. And now extending vertically from the core of the earth up through your heart up into the eighth chakra. Now we're going to stretch up into the ninth and the tenth, completely anchored in the earth, yet moving beyond the earth's atmosphere and connecting into the Milky Way. And breathe. It is your spiritual workout for the day. And from this place, as you pulsate with the Christ Consciousness's hands on your heart, front and back, as you lie in the arms, the embrace of the Divine Mother of your soul, the Father of your soul holds you all around your aura as you are stretched into the Milky Way, 
anchored into the earth, stretched around the earth horizontally. And from this access, claim who you are. Claim your strength. Claim your authenticity. Your ubiquitous light. Your magnificence. The cosmic Christ knows it. The mother of your soul knows it. You were created in her very essence. You are her shining light on the earth plane. And so be that. Let go of what has been difficult. Let go of the scratchy experiences, the crunchiness of life. Let it go. And just allow your exquisiteness to flow through. This spiritual stretch, yogic sun salutation that you have stretched out to, stretched into. Embodied, be this now. The mother has your back. The Christ consciousness has you front and back of your heart. You can go forward. You can have the light, the life, the journey, the vision, the desire, the creation. You have only to will it, to speak it, to desire it. Do that now. Stretch out happiness. Stretch the emotion of happiness out through the posture you hold that you are being. Allow happiness to caress all your bodies and systems throughout your tube of light, stretched around the earth, extended into the Milky Way, anchored into the earth. Be that. Pulsate it now. Pulsate your joy. Be the ultimate com confidence. Be all that you need. Whatever you need, call on it, reach for it, become it. And allow that imprint to deeply sear into your bones. Be the divine health. Instill the vitality that you need. Instill the passion the oomph. Be the rock. The Christ consciousness is right there. He, she is your rock. Lord Maitreya is your rock. Ask Ask him to be there for you, to give you the strength for whatever is happening in your day, any day, every day. Communicate this deeply. Com 
communicate all that you desire. You are a creator God. You have all that you need within you. You only have to reach and ask. Ask for the help with every task, no matter what it is. Jesus said this on the mount. Ask and you will receive. The earth, the children, humanity needs each and every one of us to ask for what we need, to envision what we desire. And so be that creator God. Awaken from the dream that you are not The real reality is that you are a magnificent, sovereign, powerful, exuberant, passionate, dynamic, amazing human being. Spiritual being having a human experience. Remember who you are and walk forward now in the new phase that we find ourselves in now we have begun a new phase just yesterday so be all that you require all that you want all that you need Conjure it up. And feel the pulsation of that reality around your skin boundary. The potentiality is in your auric field right now. It's up to you to act on it. To go from this moment. It's never going to come from a government, an institution. It's going to come from within you. You are the director of your life. Be that and breathe. There are guardian angels, guides, even the goddess Eris is right close by. Pallas Athene, the goddess of absolute focus. Yes, it takes focus. So what is your single third eye focusing upon? On some days you can choose kindness, goodness. Perhaps on another day, or even the same, laughter, giggling. You can choose whatever you want and breathe. We are one with the entire cosmos. It is supremely complex beyond 
definition. And yet it is truly very, very simple. Treat your life in the same manner. You don't have to know the formula as to how the sun comes up in the morning or creates the colors. You can just experience the sun and the color. And so keep your life simple. Choose what you specifically really want. And go with that. Focus on that. You will create what you focus on. Discern what you choose. For now, we are becoming at one with the entire cosmos. And it is arriving on this earth plane. And so deeply connect into the heart in order to manage and be with all that we are one with. It is a tremendous amount and yet it is simple. Remember to let go of all that is unnecessary and then it is simple. And breathe. So coming back down now from your full extension into the Milky Way, just very, very slowly, allowing your extension to come back down from, in fact, the 12th chakra down into the 11th, down into the 10th, similar to coming down an elevator slowly into the ninth into the eighth chakra and just enjoying that resonance as you pulsate being very aware of your crown chakra as you pulsate there in the eighth chakra, crown being the seventh, the nectar still flowing, your auric field, perhaps some of you can feel beyond the room that you occupy. And now bringing your extension around the earth back to your heart. Coming into your seven through one chakra system within your column. breathing and sending this experience the uh, sensual, your sentient 
experience out to your loved ones. It's an inner knowing of doing that. Somehow we all know how to do that. Trust that. Use that trust more. Trust this inner knowing more. Anchor in more. The Christ Consciousness now is delivering to you healing energies that will assist you to uh, continue these energies through your day up to the moment of the new moon. and into the next cycle. So what are your intentions? Be aware of what you want to create and really take note for indeed we have started a completely new epoch at least we have moved from 740 years into the next. So what do you want to begin now? What do you want to leave behind? Take advantage of this very day. Go deep. Be sincere. Discern what you want to take with you and what you don't. What beliefs. How can you stretch what you believe so that you can embody more, so that you can grow and expand? A belief is a thought that you keep thinking. A belief is a thought that you keep thinking. A belief is a thought that you keep thinking. So choose well. These words, this meditation is mine as well. We are always evolving. And we evolve through the emotional body. So honor each and every emotion for each emotion is also the Great Mother's Shakti touching you, caressing you, prompting you, showing you that no, don't go there. <laughs> Change your direction. Or yes, let's go for more of that. Your emotions are your navigational system Pay attention, use it well, appreciate your emotional body. My goodness, what a great job it's done all our lives. And breathe. What a marvelous ride we have all been on. And now we get to go forward into a new and greater one with so many gifts 
all around us. We have only to open our eyes and expand our vision. So coming down into the core of the earth and uh, acknowledging where we have been and who we have traveled with. Mm, giving thanks to the Christ Consciousness, thanks to the Divine Mother, Isis, Mother Mary, whoever she has been for you, whoever she is for you, the Father of our souls, the life force power of the universe, thank you. And just remember to take your time after you complete with this meditation. Namaste to you all.